Hey, what's up, you guys? It's Caboose bringing you another Mortal Kombat 11 video. And today, what I got for you guys here is my official reaction to the Combat Pack trailer for Mortal Kombat 11. It's finally here. We're going to see what the rest of the DLC looks like in this game. I hope they reveal what those two guests are going to be. I just want to see what Spawn looks like in this freaking game. But before we get into my reaction, I wanted to ask you guys, of course, if you could leave a like rating on the video as it shows your support. And I would really appreciate it. So if you could leave a like, that would be awesome. Headphone users beware, I might freak out when Spawn shows up. And with that said, let's see this trailer. Okay, Shang Tsung. Nightwolf, my current main in Mortal Kombat 11. So this is kind of what Ed Boon has been teasing on Twitter for a little while now. Yep, we've seen that as well. Oh my god! Oh, he looks perfect! Yo! The Joker's gonna be... It's freaking Arnold, man. Oh my god, it's freaking Arnold. The Joker is gonna be DLC? I'm so confused. I'm so confused. I don't know how to feel about that. Oh, damn. Is this all the release dates? October 8th for the Terminator. So, okay. So, the Terminator comes out to kind of coincide and cross-promote for the movie in October. But it's still another freaking two months for DLC. Sindel all the way at the end of November. The, the Joker is going to be DLC in a Mortal Kombat game. I will we'll have to talk a little bit more about that, but I'll tell you, I'll tell you what, I don't know how to feel about Mortal Kombat characters in Injustice. I don't know how to feel about a DC character in Mortal Kombat. Um, and then Spawn all the way in March of 2020. I mean, what can I say? I'm sure they're working hard. Uh, let's, let's just watch this again. Let's go through this again. Spawn looks perfect. I'll say that much. Let's actually, let me, let me turn down the volume here. And just play this real slow. Okay. We should just mute it. Because it sounds weird. Um, Yeah. Okay. Spawn looks perfect. Exactly how, how Spawn should look. In terms of his base design in Mortal Kombat. Exactly like the comics. Perfect design. I am so happy. This guy. He looks amazing. Now I just can't wait to see what the gear and the customization is going to be like for the character. But man, I really don't know how to feel about this. The Joker, like a DC character. I mean, if there's any DC character who makes it in a Mortal Kombat game, it makes sense that it's someone like the Joker, you know, one of the more recognizable villains and obviously a pretty violent character. But I still, I'm not sure how to feel about that. But, oh man, Arnold Schwarzenegger is the Terminator making his way in a Mortal Kombat game. He's got the shotgun and everything. This is hype. Right here, this is hype. I am so, so excited for this. So that's it. That is your roster of DLC characters in Mortal Kombat 11. That's your six characters. I wonder if there's going to be a Combat Pack 2 down the line. But man, I mean, Spawn, great. Terminator, great. Sindel, obviously. All the main Mortal Kombat characters that they included, I'm very happy about. It's just, again, I'm really not sure how to feel about the Joker. Maybe I'll warm up more to it when the character drops or when we see a trailer for him. But, yeah, as of right now, I'm really not sure how to feel about it. And I'm so upset. I gotta wait how many months until I can play Spawn all the way in March of 2020. I mean, at the same time, you know, I understand a lot of people had the expectation that the DLC characters were going to drop monthly. But it looks like they're taking a lot more time with these. They want to make sure that they come out perfect. Um, and maybe they just don't want to, you know... They, they don't want to get stuck on the crunch. The time crunch that we've seen in gaming as of late. So, yeah, it's tough. We're going to have to we're gonna have to have do some waiting for a lot of these DLC characters. But uh, hopefully these characters are worth the wait. I mean, for me, obviously, Spawn is going to be worth the wait. But I, I just wish, out of all these characters... I wish Spawn wasn't the one they left for last, you know, but maybe they are saving the best for last. But, um, oh boy, <laughs> that's my reaction to the combat pack trailer for Mortal Kombat 11. I, I don't know how to feel. I don't know how to feel. Uh, everything else looks great, though. The only thing that has me 
hesitant is the Joker, but everything else looks fantastic. And yeah, with that said, I'm now going to kick it to you guys. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. What do you think about the full DLC roster for Mortal Kombat 11? What do you think about the Joker, Spawn, the Terminator? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And of course, if you enjoy this reaction, if you could leave a like rating on it, it shows your support. And I would really appreciate it. I'm Caboose, and you can click on screen to make your way to one of the other videos on the channel, or you can click my logo to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Please follow me on Instagram and Twitter and like me on Facebook. Those links are in the description. Drop a like if you enjoyed, leave a comment if you have an opinion, and subscribe if you're new. See you guys later.